Well, I'm a firm believer in the Great Commission. My father was a military officer. My wife's father was a military officer. We both spent high school in third world countries. And both of us had had powerful born-again experiences with missionaries, Christian missionaries in those respective countries. And so we got to see firsthand the body of Christ, the Great Commission in action. In fact, uh, I did my first baptism in the South China Sea at the age of 16. Uh, I didn't have a clue what I was doing, but all I knew is I had to put somebody in the water and say in the name of Father, Son, Holy Spirit, and, you know, you're baptized. And so I was sold out at the age of 16 for missions. Uh, I went into the military, left the military after four years uh, to go to seminary. I've been in uh, ordained ministry of some kind uh, for about 34 years. My wife and I and our kids moved to Pittsburgh in the summer of 93. I started walking the streets uh, in June of 1993, 26 years ago. I was going to seminary at the time, and so in 94, the seminary shut down and everybody came down to the new wineskins of, of 1994. And I did a workshop, in fact I've done a workshop of some kind uh, every wineskins I've been part of. In 1997, the next wineskins I brought a uh, large contingency of uh, homeless men and women. Uh, out of the nine uh, new wineskins conferences, I I've missed two. I just love to see the excitement for the gospel going to the nations. I love to see uh, people worshiping with their hands raised. I love the worship teams that uh, wineskins always brings in. And I love to be able to go back to Shepherd's Heart and I love to tell uh, our congregation about uh, what God is doing, the stories. You get to hear the body of Christ in action. Those who understand what it means to be willing to go to the four corners of the earth. And then you get to see them every three years. You get to talk with them. You get to share what's working, what's not working. You get to share insights and spiritual truths. You get to pray get to pray with some of the most powerful prayer warriors and intercessors. I get to fall in love once again and be reminded of why I do what I do because I, I get to hear the passionate stories of these amazing men and women uh, who are sold out for the gospel. That's why I keep coming back.